what I'm talking about. Come on, baby. Let's do it. Get it, buddy. You're going the wrong way. <laughs> You're going the opposite way. <laughs> if you were gonna, so you have got a guitar now. If you could play anything with your guitar, what would you play? I don't have a guitar. Well, when you have a guitar, let's say you have a guitar and you know how to play it and everything like that, what would you play? Uh, I would play your You would play my songs? Yeah. I would steal them. That was a very good taste. I'd steal them. Like I would steal them. <laughs> and then I could play better and then everyone would like on the version of my song. You, so you're going to steal my oh, songs. Oh, dang. You're going to play them better and then everyone's going to like your music better? <laughs> That's actually pretty much how most music gets written. <laughs> <laughs> So that's that sounds like a solid plan. I'm, just do what you do, but I do it way better. You just do, I, yeah, I'm gonna do what you do. I'm gonna do it ten times better, and everyone's gonna like me more. Oh, okay, All right. sounds fine. All right, what would your songs be called? Now um, he's young and relevant, and you're not. No, yeah, I know he's relevant. And I'm not. They're relevant. gonna be. Uh, my songs are gonna be the same. I really thought it would take him longer to figure all this out. So um, I've kept my guardsmen down. It seems like. Thing. Same thing as my songs. Okay? Just better. It, your album would just say, Tim Swanson songs, just better. Just better and by Silas. Is that right? Yeah. And and everybody's going to say, I'm the one that teached um, Tim Swanson. You're going to tell everybody <laughs> you're the one who taught me how to play? Everyone's going to think that I teach you how to do it. <laughs> <laughs> wow, man! It sounds like I gotta step up my game. He definitely has a head start. He didn't start playing music until you were. Teenager. I didn't start playing music until I was fifteen, so fifteen or sixteen, I think. And so this so people might claim you better than. Ah, uh, we'll see. We'll see. <laughs> we'll see about that. Did you ever play music? Musical instrument? Yeah. Piano. You? You've never played our piano. You've never even sat down at our piano once. Yes, I have. When? Oh, I don't know, maybe when you're not around. <laughs> Alright, that's fair I know enough. how to play lightly, bro. Why are you doing this in front of the people? All the people that are watching. What's up, girl? How you doing? You want to go out with me sometime? A G? Is that meant to be a G? The guitar is not a G, but the G is a note on the guitar, so yeah, sort of. Alright, let's do it. I think we have been here before. We have. We have been here before. This is the time for my baby. So we're here to get a looper pedal. We are. Yeah, we're gonna go find the pedals. Daddy, Allison says we're standing Daddy, in the walkway. We are. All right, looper pedal. Where is the pedals? Microphones, keyboards, amps, uh, guitar stuff is gonna be not here. Okay. Ouch! 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 Yesterday was leg day and that was painful. Where is it? No, do not sit on my leg or I will throw you off. We've gotta find somebody who can help us. This part down what? Loop station? Yeah, yeah, the top one for 99. That was one of the ones I was looking okay. at. But I want to use, there's supposed to be two of them. I want to use them both. They're really easy, simple ones, and they're both 100 bucks. And then you're going to get it for me for Christmas? She doesn't want to get me a Christmas present. I do want to get you a Christmas present. We just didn't talk about that. We just talked about it. Uh, just now? <laughs> just now we talked about Wait, it. Wait, is this your day off? Yeah, it's my day off. Alright, eventually someone's going to be able to help us and then it really wants to look at your face. Look at this beautiful, gorgeous girl. <laughs> mm. Alright, let's find somebody to help.
deleted it. Shoot. <laughs> I'm take my wallet out of my pocket because that's getting in the way. I think I want this amp too. Oh, this amp? Yeah, that used one. Oh. Because I like doing it on the cheaps. Oh. <laughs> ah, I see. Fair enough. All right. This is something that I have always, always wanted. It's one of these looper pedal thingies that you like click on it and it records what you do and then you click it again and it records it again and again and you just make layers until you're like, got up, like it sounds like you have musical friends. <laughs> so this is like one of the huge passions I have outside of the world of cigars, which has now completely swallowed me by the way. So cigars was a passion for me for the longest time and now it is definitely like a career style job. Like I love cigars and I love the business of cigars, but certainly you have to have passions even outside of work, even at a job you love. When they say that you'll, if you love the job you have, you'll never work a day in your life, which I've already talked about in another video. But the truth is like, even if you do what you love, you have to have time and space to do something that requires no output, that requires no excellence of you, that you don't have to perform and nobody expects anything of you. And for me, right now that's music, which is which is weird because that used to actually, music used to actually be the career thing and cigars were like the hang out and play poker with the guys thing. And so it's, it, I guess it sort of flipped on me. But at the end of the day, like I, somebody sat in my office just the other week and challenged me, said, Tim, you've got to have a life outside of, out of sight of the business, outside of Cigars Daily, outside of cigars. And certainly it's fun and I enjoy every second of it, but it does have a certain level of demand to it. And so this has been the thing I've been able to do and really kick back, put my feet up and relax. And I don't have to, like coincidentally it's music, but I don't have to perform. <laughs> I just get to do it and have fun. So I try to do this like once a day when I get home from work. I usually practice Spanish lessons on my phone and then play my guitar for a little while. And I can usually fit those two things in before bed. But here's what I want to know from you guys. What is the big passion in your life? Like what is the thing outside of work? Even if you have a job that you love and especially if you have a job that you hate, what is the thing that you do outside of that, the passion you have, the thing that drives you, that you will do to relax and absolutely enjoy? And if it's cigars, it's fantastic. If it's something else, put that down in the comments below because I'd love to know what truly is inspiring you guys and making, like, driving you to relax, I guess. <laughs> anyway, guys, I am going to mess around with this pedal a little bit more and enjoy myself. I have been writing some music that will probably pop up on the channel. It's only a matter of time before I can't contain it anymore. So thank you guys so much for watching. You guys have a wonderful week. I'll see you guys later on on the channel. This is Sam signing off. I'll see you all in the comments. Okay, so I guess I jumped the gun because I, I really did write a song today, which is a big thing for me because I've had writer's block for like the last five years. Truthfully, I've been stuck on this one song. I haven't been able to finish it. So I just, today I started something totally new and I wrote, I don't know, a third of a song. So uh, I wanted to share that with you guys. Like some guys, some songwriters like want to protect their music and like hide it until it's ready, until it's perfect. 
that's not how I am. I just, I, when I write stuff, I want to share it from, with people. So uh, please drop a comment with what you think of it. Let me know what you think of the song. And if you like it, I really appreciate it. And if you don't, I, I don't know what to do for you. Sorry. <laughs> the village post stood a hollow tree it gave no shade and it did not grow the people they loved it so they would gather around the thing telling the stories of the hope they hold yeah the king would come and say there are better places the people they would never listen to him the boat that rests on the floor of the sea breathes life for the living when we lose the ones we need oh we always say Hold your head up high Listen to our Father's words The world is born broken But life will always find a way And then probably some like Oh, 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 oh Something like that. I don't really know. It's going to have to take its own direction, I guess. Anyway, drop a comment with what you think. Thank you guys so much for watching here on the channel. And if you haven't done so, please subscribe. If you hated the song, maybe don't subscribe because there might even be more music. I don't know. I can't tell what's going to happen because this is my passion and it's just going to be what it's going to be. Have a great day, guys.